Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and welcome on back to another reaction video. If you have no idea who I am, my name is Sam, aka OGB Reacts. I'm a first time movie reactor here on YouTube, posting every Tuesday and Friday, and I'm also a streamer over on Twitch. Today's video is a level 5 Patreon tier movie request from Ian Forbes, and Ian wants me to watch That Thing You Do from 1996. As a chunk of you do know, I did a lot of Tom Hanks movies about mid last year or so, I don't know time anymore, but obviously this was not one of them. So I know nothing about this movie except that it has Tom Hanks in it. But nonetheless, as per usual, I am excited to watch. So let's go on ahead and get started. First of all, thank you so much to Ian for subscribing at that tier over on Patreon. Really do appreciate that support and I hope you specifically enjoy this reaction. And to those of you who are here right now and watching, thank you so much for being here and thank you so much for watching. And to those of you over on Patreon, I also do appreciate you guys over there thank you so much for being there thank you so much for your support and i hope you're enjoying all the full unedited reaction videos and the access to the polls so yeah i'm ready to dive on into this and i hope you guys are too really do hope that you guys like this reaction and i shall see you on the other side enjoy Ah, appliance seller by day, drummer by night. Oh, let's just call us the band you're about to hear. How about the Corvettes? Well, see, I was thinking like the chord. Chord vets. Chord vets. Huh. Like chords in our music. That's fun, actually. I like that. It's, it's, uh, it's witty. It's like this, so it's hers. So it's one of the senses. Upper body strength. Oh, come on. Upper, upper. Get up there. Come on. I don't get hurt. Like, oh. it's like bird guys. Chad fell down. Oh no, did he break his arm and he's the drummer and we got this man at the appliance store who's gonna fill in for him. The cogs are turning. I am observant. <laughs> How about sitting in for Chad just for tonight? Just for tonight. Hmm. Why? Asshole. Just broke his arm. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yep, nothing he can't handle. That's it, the wonders. The wonders. Lenny. The wonders. Yeah, it looks like the Oneaters. Uh. <laughs> no, the, the wonders. Got it. Looks like the Oneaters. Oneaters. This is hardly a date, guy. I thought we were going to the movies and dinner at the club. This is the club. <laughs> How do you sell a chicken to a deaf man? You're a jerk, Ken. You say? This guy's hey, oh, you like peanut tomorrow? gallery. Chicken! Eat my shorts, Ken. Shut up! I'll kick your ass. You know what? Good for green suit, man. The Oneaters. No, not Oneaters. No. I think it sounds better like this, actually. All right. Lots more people dancing now. They're feeling it. It's definitely a catchy song. I like it. Oh, no. He's. Oh. I added another week in the cast. That was way too fast, man. No, it was great. Uh, no, it was great. It was, it was wicked, wicked, dead. I want you playing at my place next weekend. What do you say? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I wonder how many times in this movie they're gonna be playing this song because this is like the third time. <laughs> Just want to say that I uh, love your song, love that music. I want to know where I can get the record. Outside. Hey, pops. Hey, pops. I'll give you a pop. And make a record. Hey, was not that our fan? The peanut gallery, yeah. Right in the church. That's amazing. Ah, you look great. Yeah, she's got a very pretty girlfriend, doesn't he? Is it serious, you know? Very <laughs> serious. I'm single. <laughs> what about the bass player? He's married. Damn! You shouldn't have to work on Sunday to support a family, should you? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, he'd be very mad nowadays. <laughs> Would you step into my office, please? Um, uh, okay. You know, guy. Suspicious. And I think this is a hit record. I'm not sure about this. <laughs> it's a standard management contract. It says if I do my job, you guys make money. Huh. How do I make money? And how would you like to hear that thing you do on the radio? <laughs> Give me a pen. I'm signing. You're signing. We're all signing. <laughs> Hi, are you Tina? Uh-oh. Yes, I'm Tina. <laughs> yeah, I'm Tina. <laughs> a local eerie 
fans got a new record out. Just won the Murphy Hurst talent show a couple of weeks ago. This is Erie's own Oh, oh, my God. God. oh damn! Wow! They got on the radio. <laughs> Avocado. The this screams in the distance. Oh my God. <laughs> Good for them. I am Spartacus! <laughs> oh, I can't believe I missed it. Well, I'm too busy with the dentist. I'm getting the crown replaced on my number 15 molar. It's it's going to take like all day tomorrow with the dentist. All day? Mm. Late Erie's own, the own needer. Not the, stop with the own needers. Oh no, please do well. The bike's not a one. Oh, not a great. <laughs> Woo, great start. Oh no! Time for everything to go wrong. They boot us off the stage, no. Phil. Damn. Well, son of a gun, we're right on time. Enter Tom Hanks. Well, I have heard your record, guy, and I like it. We'd like to release it and add the wonders to the Playtone stable of artists. Pretty good. Damn. I have to talk this over with the rest of the band. Yes, you do. Next, this wonders with the O-N-E, it doesn't work. It's confusing. Oh, From yeah. now on, you boys will just be simply the wonders. You'll be out on the road with them until Labor Day. Not me. What? Well, I joined the United States Marine Corps back at home. So, um, uh... I have to report to South Carolina at the end of August, which means that I have to leave the band at the end of August. Diane Dane! Diane Dane! Oh, we love I, you! I had my first boy-girl thing. I had a, was for a picture of you on a record sleeve. Yeah, charming. Yeah, lovely. Oh, no. Oh, is that them? <laughs> oh, yeah. Nice, crispy red suits. <laughs> All right. This needs to go well. Those trademark glasses. I am so sure that this group of guys we're so sick of this song by the end of this movie. Oh! Hey! That's amazing! They were number 93 on the top 100. Hell yeah! Ooh, damn! Oh, wait! 21! Oh, man. There's gonna be some drama down the line in this movie. I know it, but at least they're happy right now! There's always gotta be drama. All their songs have been good. They've all been super catchy, and I really like them all. What about Guy there? He had a girlfriend back in Erie. She fell in love with her dentist. No, well, that's too bad. <laughs> the dentist. Uh oh. You fellas look great in gold. Have I told you? I love it. What's in the letter? That thing you do is the fastest rising single in the history of the Playtone label. As of tomorrow morning, you wonders, you've got the number seven record in the country. <gasps> oh my God, wow! California? Disneyland? Yeah. <laughs> Disney? That's me. Disney! Oh. Wow. Oh no! Hey, hold it! She's with us! Her own boyfriend didn't. Oh my god! Girl, get off! You didn't even get your own girlfriend in the car! Damn! Okay. Damn, he's caring more about uh, <laughs> his friend's girlfriend than his friend! You know, Faye's not feeling very good. I want to know when we're going to get into recording studio. Well, now, first things first, fellas. He does not care. <laughs> Lenny, why don't you go and see if you can visit the cockpit? Tell him it's your birthday. Go, go, go. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, it's going well. It's They're doing good. There's just a little few things here and there that are kind of like, 
Hmm, right? Look at these little sailor outfits. Keep dancing, goofball. <laughs> Keep dancing, the goofball. Save the line. Uh, we're being invaded. Run out of the shot. Hold on. Play back. What? What? <laughs> what? Yeah, you should have told us about this, Rick. And I need a movie. Why is he being such a weenie? Knock it off. Sally, how's your pals in the sheriff's department? Boy, you got Oh, everyone's sucking up. <laughs> is it true that Don Drysdale gave you a sock and a snooker? Oh, no, Fred. Oh. A, a sock and a snooker. I wrote that thing you do. I wrote many other songs that I think we should make an appointment and share. What is Jimmy doing? Oh, God. Jimmy. Yeah, like I got time on my hand. You want to oh. get paid away from me? He doesn't know. To him. You have got to read the room, play the cards you're dealt, not do what you just did. Diane warned me about this. Diane Dane? Never trust a label. And I'm beginning to believe her. I feel terrible. I'm going to go back to bed. Oh. Yeah, that's a good idea. Uh, he he really is being a weenie, though. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, no, wait. Excuse me, sir. Oh. Um, I want to inform you that I'm going to be joining a ring soon, and um, I can already do 200 push-ups. Coffee, Four, please. Thank you. Five, six, I like this kid. seven. Man, come on! He still wants to go in, even even with everything going on. Like, yeah, I guess he really wants to go in. Oh, teach their own. Take this young man to the blue spot. <laughs> He's living. Looks like they're kind of busy doing the cock and bull with Dell there. Dell? Yeah, Dell Paxton. He's one of the regulars. Oh. Well, sit down. Buy me a drink. <laughs> you are my biggest fan. Oh. <laughs> you are my biggest fan. Nice. You gotta keep on playing, no matter with who. But sooner or later, something makes you crazy. Money, women, the road. Hell, yeah, man, it's already setting in. Good morning, guy. We have a crisis here. Your bass player has disappeared, and you are still in bed. Just calling to tell you to get your patootie down to the television studio. You're going to be on TV tonight. Oh, no. Where the hell is he? Disneyland. Oh, my God. They took him. Oh my god. Ow. That's gotta hurt. Yeah, really. Teen Good lord. The wonders to the stage, please. Boys, we go. Teen sensation. The 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 fabulous in the black suits. Have I told you that? Hi. Fabulous in the black suit. Five, four. Three. Okay, don't bomb. Come on, don't bomb. This is live television. No vomiting. <laughs> Jimmy careful girls, he's engaged. Congratulations, Jimmy. What? Wait, really? Or? Oh, no. Ah! This girl crying. Oh. <laughs> Where'd you get the idea that we're engaged? We're not. It's the last thing I need in the world. Damn. Are you kidding? Jeez, but I... Hmm. Did is she the one to to say that or can I say something? Hey, the fair Fay wishes to address us all. So is See, he's so much nicer to her than this. Jimmy. Ugh. From now on you stay away from me. Ooh. I used to think that was the real you when you smile. But now I know that you don't mean any of it. Oh. And you just save it for all your songs. Wow. Huh. Should have dumped you in Pittsburgh. You're an asshole. Take those stupid sunglasses off. What's wrong with you? I was looking forward to working with you. You know, you're a liar, White. You're a liar. Where is this coming from? Where is this aggression coming from? I quit. I quit. <laughs> I quit. <laughs> I quit, Mr. White. Wow. Okay. Bye. Where is Lenny? I have no idea. 
No, he is not getting. I'm so happy. Do you guys know what a himbo is? He is a himbo. We still have a hit record. Yeah, you do. One hit wonders. It's a very common tale. Damn. Jeez, it all fell apart so quickly. <laughs> that sucks. I don't know, with his talent, he'll be able to find something else. What do you call that? <laughs> I am Spartacus. <laughs> hey, Dell. <laughs> Can I jam with you a bit? Oh. You want to jam with me? Sure. <laughs> Dream sure. come true. One, two, three, four. Well, he likes jazz so much. Uh... Faye, she's still here? Yeah. She's sitting there in the coffee shop at the counter alone. Now, where I come from, that just ain't right. <laughs> <laughs> Were you in love when you read with that Tina woman? She wasn't right for you. No, she really wasn't. Was she a good kisser? <laughs> None of this would have happened if you hadn't joined the band. And I mean that in a good way. I mean, it's true. He really uh, changed the course of this entire band's history. Stay with me. Before you go, let me ask you one question. When was the last time you were decently kissed? <laughs> I mean, truly, truly. Yeah. Good and kissed. Yep. I don't think Jimmy did that for <laughs> a bit. New Year's Eve, 61. So, like, before your relationship? <laughs> because didn't the talent show say 64 and she just said 61? So, she, oh, did she not get a good kiss with her her boyfriend of two and a half years? Oh, no. All right, time for y'all to be in L.A. together. He treated her so nicely while Jimmy was being a butthurt little baby boy, all right? Which, I'm still not sure exactly why. I think he just seemed too good for it, like he thought. He's living for it. He's just like, hey, 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 hey. Was he supposed to be someone, by the way? Oh, Guy and Faye Patterson were married. Uh, they raised four children in Venice, California, before moving. Uh, they found the Sound Conservatory. Oh, I didn't realize this was based on a true story. Wow. Leonard well, Hayes is the manager of the Golden Eagle Hotel and Casino. Wow. He's currently single. Oh, no. <laughs> This was so much fun. I really, really enjoyed this. It's really sad that they broke up uh, by the end of it because they were so happy uh, up until a point together playing. And again, Jimmy was kind of a little baby boy a little bit. I still am not quite exactly sure why. Truly a really fun, entertaining movie. I had a great time watching this film. For the most part, it was very, you know, upbeat and lighthearted and everything while telling a story. It was really fun watching them kind of just rise up from just a band that had a completely different drummer to someone filling in for that drummer and he ended up being really good and and then they just kind of shot up and unfortunately kind of crashed a little bit but I guess in some ways it was for the better. I do feel really bad for Faye because she was nothing but nice I feel to Jimmy and again Jimmy was kind of a little baby boy uh when they started getting like more attention he started to get worse and it's like I I guess I can't necessarily wrap my head around exactly why like I kind of said towards the end I think he thought maybe he was just too good for the things or some of the things that they were doing and like I know that he said that he wanted to like record new stuff that was the objective to record new records but he was just I don't know I I, I can't understand the mindset that he was in I mean I've never been in a band I've never been anywhere near any sort of level that they were at so I don't know the stresses that come with it the only reference I do know is movies like this and just what I've heard, I guess. So yeah, I don't know, but I don't, I don't know. It's just like, I don't think I would be 
like that. And then the whole, like, engagement thing, like, I don't know exactly what the context was behind that. I tried looking it up really quickly as I was, like, as there was, like, a slow part in the movie. I know people in the comments will probably also talk about this, but from what I quickly read, it was something about the uh, Beatles appearing on the Ed Sullivan show and how there was something very similar that happened uh, in regards to what happened then in that scene. But either way, that whole engagement thing on the screen, you would think that someone of two and a half years into a relationship wouldn't be as seething angry with their partner if that happened, especially if she didn't do it, which I actually still don't know if she did it or not. Like if she said it, I don't think she did. I think it was just a thing that the people, the producers, the whoever who was behind the camera doing the, you know, little text graphics or whatever just did just to spice it up a little. So the fact that he was just so angry was just like, that's so ugly. Stop. Like, why are you getting so seething angry? at your girlfriend of again two and a half years and getting like so like offended about a whole like engagement thing you would think that that would be like the typical pathway like i know everyone's different but like you know what i mean so yeah he definitely bothered me a little bit that that jimmy boy overall had a really good time watching this film this was really great again tom hanks I mean, he did really well in the role that he was playing. Everybody else did a good job as well. I really enjoyed myself. It was very just overall a very fun, not super, super serious film. It was relatively lighthearted. And I, again, I just, I overall really liked it. And of course, really do hope that you guys enjoyed it as well. And if you did, please feel free to like the video. And if you aren't already, please feel free to subscribe. And if you want to watch the full unedited version of this video or to any other Tom Hanks films or to anything else on my channel, you can absolutely do so over on my Patreon. It is $5 a month for that. And to those of you over on Patreon already, thank you so much for being there. Thank you so very much for your support. And I hope you're enjoying all the full unedited reaction videos and the access to the polls. If you want to find me outside of YouTube, you can absolutely do so. You can find me pretty much anywhere at OGB Plays. Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, all that good stuff, but I'm mainly over on Twitch and streaming over there. And of course, a big ol' thank you to Ian Forbes who requested this film. Really do appreciate that support on Patreon. And thank you for the request. Really hope that you specifically enjoyed this reaction. Once again, really did enjoy this. Hope you guys did too. And I hope to see you all in the next reaction video, whatever that may be. Okie dokie. Toodaloo. Adios. And goodbye. Bye.